Boy, owner of Off Leash Canine Training. I'm here with four and a half year old Riker doing a private seminar in Louisiana. Um, Riker knows a decent amount of basic obedience. Nothing's really solid. Nothing's 100% reliable, especially if he gets distracted, kind of goes out the window. Um, he also has reactivity issues outside of the house with people, dogs, cars, horses, kind of a little bit of everything. Um, he'll bark aggressively, uh, react to. So we're going to work on that. I'm going to try to show you what Riker does right now. Riker, come. Riker, come. Riker, come. Come. Hey, come. Riker, come. Come. Come here. So this is obedience with a little bit of distraction. Down. 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 Riker, heel. Riker, heel. you can kind of see what his obedience looks like with very 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 minimal distraction so looking forward to showing you his progress at the end of this week I would tie him, I would tie, there's some rings on the wall and I'd tie him to a ring on the wall because um, I knew I couldn't hold the horse and control him at the same time and it was just incessant. And then it got to the point where I'd tie him outside, there's a fire, oh, there's a pipe out there I could tie him to, and from outside I could tie him. And then I thought, God, what am I going to do if he gets loose, if he like actually breaks away? Yeah. So then I started putting him in the car and just and from the car he brought me six. Have him sit. And then down him. And then same right around him. Do a lap around him. All right. And then go ahead and take the horse away. Take the horse, go ahead and take the horse away. Okay. Yeah. And then go ahead and release him. Yeah. Then go ahead and release him. Okay, Good. And then ride around, go around him a little bit again, George, if you will. All right, and then go ahead and after this, ride away from him. Good. And then go ahead and uh, release him. Okay, Good boy. Our training, whatever we want. Don't get too close. I gotta get a couple seconds. 
So what do you think? Better than before? Oh, unbelievable. Night and day. Oh, yeah, night before. Oh, right. wow. She would have been sitting in the saddle. <laughs> She'd have been sitting in the saddle. Like lunging, growling. Come on, boy. It's all right. Yeah. It's that third. Come on. So is he like actively like trying to uh, like attack him pretty much? Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, when he was 12 weeks old, as I told you, the first time I walked him into the barn, he's jumping he on. Ran him. over, jumped to this horse. Ran over, jumped up on the door, and was snapped. Tasmanian devil, huh? Yeah. Well, it looks like he got it fixed. Oh, God. Go ahead and release him. Okay, break. Break. It's Good a boy. Break. Down. That's better. There you go. There you go. Hey, you go. Hey, you like that? Like, yeah, that's right. He's like, give me some like attention. That, Good boy. Good boy. Huh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Good boy, Riker. Good boy. Then go ahead and release him. Okay, break. Break. Good boy. Good boy. There you go. You're good. <laughs> yeah, by all rights, when he came over, I mean, even if he hadn't chased George. He would have jumped up and reacted and tried to bite his face. face. Yeah. Walk slow, slower, and then say his name and stop. Good, and then release him. Good boy.
Better than before? <laughs> Wait, I said better than before? Oh, okay. been, like, on the fence, like, really cool. That's awesome. Hey guys, what's going on? This is Nick White, owner of Off Leash Canine Training. I hope you enjoyed my latest private training seminar. If so, click this video and you can watch over 40 of my previous training seminars for people all throughout the world. And don't forget to click the subscribe button below, that way you can get weekly video updates in your email. Thanks for watching guys.